Hello, welcome back to module 8 of setting up a journal with OJS 3.0. This is unit 4 of website settings, languages. OJS 3.0 supports many different publication languages, and in this unit I'll demonstrate how to activate them. To access language settings, enter your dashboard through the top right-hand corner of your journal's homepage. In the left-hand navigation, hover over Settings and select Website. Languages is the fourth tab along the top of the page. The default language included in the initial OJS installation is English. Additional language packages must be downloaded from the OJS website and installed into your existing OJS system by your site administrator. That work is beyond the scope of this tutorial, but I'll quickly show you what you can do as a journal manager once the language is installed. All languages that have been installed will appear on this page. The primary locale radio button allows you to set the default language of your website. This is the language the page appears in. UI stands for user interface, and selecting this option allows your visitors to choose this language over the default language when viewing your web page. If, for example, we had set Portuguese as the primary locale, but left English enabled as a UI language, visitors to your website would be able to toggle between the two languages. Submissions refers to the language of the submission page. Having more than one language enabled will allow authors to choose which language the submission page displays in. Forms refers to all of the different forms that are being used by different roles in the editorial process to accomplish tasks. Enabling the language for forms will provide that language option when using those forms. Anytime new languages get added to your installation, or if the language preferences of your journal change, you can come back to this page at any time and adjust your settings and preferences. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you again in the next unit.